frick is up guys welcome back to my cottage living lp and my name is sheree for those of you who are new and here we have snow she's in the middle of making some sugar cookies last time we left off in the first part we ran an errand for agatha and we are still in the middle of running an errand for Agatha and we have to make her a, a dessert which we're doing right now we're gonna pop some sugar cookies in the oven um, we got our little cow and our llama over here um, they're all clean and fed and full um, our little chicks are doing good over here they're also full and clean um, our hens are doing good um, we also have some more roosters and birds over here on the other side of the house that I didn't even realize so after we're done with our sugar cookies we're gonna go over there and make sure they're taken care of um, and it looks like a fire has broken out already. Her cooking skill is not good. So let it, let's extinguish this fire as quick as we can. We're not going to call the fire department because there is no time. So looks like she got that out with minimum trouble um so she got 410 dollars to replace her stove so we're just gonna go ahead and do ooh 600 bucks though we're gonna go ahead and replace it but i think i know a way to get that money back once we get into town so we're gonna try to replace that money Hopefully we can once we get into town and we bring Agatha her cookies. And it looks like her cookies turned out excellent quality too. I don't know how she swung that because her cooking skill is not that great. But <laughs> she ended up with an excellent pile of sugar cookies that we're going to bring over to Agatha. So I'm sure she'll be happy about that. So let's just go and clean up the little chicken coop before we leave. Um, I don't want to leave our lot and leave our animals in distress. So let's just make sure everybody's fed and full and clean and happy before we leave. Look at the little bunny. So cute. must take care of the animals before we leave and make sure everybody's taken care of that is going to be like my main thing i know every time i send her away from this lot i'm going to be worried about my animals we also have lots of bees over here so let's sell some of this honey and see how much we get for that because we need to replace that 600 bucks for that stove Now, this is something that I would never, ever do in real life. I am not a fan of in insects and bugs and bees and stuff like that. That's just not my thing, but it is very cute for the game. How many of you are uh, insect fans or bug fans? That is just not me. <laughs> There's no way I would do that ever. But it is a nice little add-on to the game. I think it's cute. 36 bucks for honey. Um, we didn't get that much for it, but it's better than nothing. Oh, look at the little birdies popping out of the tree. Oh, that's so cute. So we're going to have Snow go over here and try to sing a little song. Or she's going to play something for the uh, bunny rabbits. And this plays in like perfectly with the whole Snow White theme. She's playing music for the animals. So cute. Look, here comes another one. So cute. Oh, this is so cute. 
She actually has a pretty decent singing skill. We're trying to get her uh, guitar skill up too. Because she's going to be like good with, you know, playing all kinds of music. Work starts in an hour for her, but I don't think I'm going to send her to work. We might just skip out on that for the day. Um, I don't know if she has any vacation days. Um, if she doesn't, then we'll just, we'll just take one. <laughs> or we'll just skip work all together. But we have lots of errands to run. So I think we're going to end up going in the town. And I'll meet you there. All right, we have arrived. Um, now, all we have to do is find Agatha and deliver her little cookies to her. Hopefully she likes them. They're excellent quality, so I don't know why she wouldn't, but let's see if we can find her. I think they have this new thing where you can like focus the camera there it is you can focus the camera to find the sim that you're looking for that is like super helpful there she is agatha where have you been <laughs> so we're gonna have to just bring and deliver these cookies over to her and then see what else she has for us to do Um, I don't think we're going to have her going to work today. Uh -huh. Here are your cookies. <laughs> she seems very happy about that. <laughs> so now we have to find two single sims. So I guess we are going to go around and just ask um sims if they're single or not and that will be um once i find two single sims i think that'll complete our errand for agatha this is like a three-part errand run here like this is like it's like every time you do one thing she wants you to do something else so that's what we're gonna do Let's have her go over here and have a root beer float, her favorite drink. <laughs> and we're just gonna go here and ask some Sims if they're single or not and see what they say. She just rides right into the bar. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Yeah, put that bike in your inventory. We don't want to be leaving our bike anywhere. So by the time we're done, Snow's going to know everyone in town. Because she's just introducing herself to everyone around. She sees... I also have to get my money back for... Um, for replacing that stove so I'm hoping to run into some celebrity sims maybe we can go some places that uh, this guy's married maybe we can go someplace where celebrities frequent because I know if I get an if I can get an autograph I can get it appraised and get a nice amount of money for that so we could at least replace that money that we use for our stove Oh, she's married too. Everyone's married. Even the bartender is married. How are we gonna find two single sounds? <sighs> what do we have here? Judith Ward out here. Okay, this is my Judith Ward. I did a makeover for her a long time ago. Um, and this is what my Judith Ward looks like. So let's get her in a decent outfit and then go ask her for her autograph.
Hopefully we can get her autograph. <laughs> she's like laid out on the floor. And already she's like, mm-mm, nope. <laughs> Let's try to make friends or be friendly and then ask her again. I'm gonna keep asking until she gives it to me. She'll take a picture with me, but she won't give me an autograph. Come on. Come on, Judith. Don't be that way. Let's attempt a friendly introduction. And I'm gonna keep asking her. <laughs> you gonna give me an autograph today. She was looking good though. <laughs> she looks way better than before. Oh my gosh, she keeps saying no. <laughs> I think the girl here in the pink too, Jade, I think she's a celebrity too. Yeah, I'm going to get her autograph too. I don't know if she is like a global superstar though. I don't think she is. So it may not be worth as much as Judith's autograph. She'll hug me, but she won't give me an autograph. Come on. I need to replace my stuff. Okay, I think she's giving it to me. She is. Okay, so we got that. And I'm about to appraise it right here. So you just go in your inventory and click appraise, and she will make a call. Okay, we got Judas. Yeah, Judas, right now Judas autograph says sell for 50 bucks, but after it gets appraised, it'll be worth more. Oh yeah, Jade's, Jade's autograph is only worth like 20 bucks, so yeah, she's not a, a high uh, celebrity, like she must be like a D-list celebrity. Let's see how much Judas is worth. After being appraised, it's 400 bucks, but before it was appraised, it was only like 50 bucks so oh it looks like the festival is popping up behind us as we speak look at this i wish we had i had some crops to like enter into the contest but i do not have any crops as of yet because we're just getting started with this lp i wish we could go over but it doesn't look like anyone's headed over there yet so I don't know if there will be like much for us to do. We don't have any crops to really um, show or enter any contests. So I'm not sure if we should go over or not. Maybe we should save that for another episode. I'm going to ask all these sims if they're single too. Because we're still looking to find two single sims. And then we have to report back to Agatha. So it looks like we've gotten our money to replace our I mean to replace the money we use to replace our stove so that's good we got most of that money back because we don't have a whole lot of money to be spending so this is a quick little side hustle um, to get money just hang out where all the celebrity sims are at and you can get that money too so now we just have to report over to Agatha again about our single sims we found. 
if we can find her let's focus the camera back on her okay he is happy to offer snow a favor for being a member of the village community if snow wants to carry forward oh uh, okay maybe later i mean let's go and report over to agatha like you're distracting me <laughs> little grocery boy <laughs> i don't know is this him a teenager or is he an adult we're gonna go over here and talk to agatha about the single sims right yeah, report on single sound. So let's go do that first before we do anything else. The little grocery delivery boy is kind of cute though. But I think Snow's too old for him. <laughs> he might only be a teen sim. So let's let Agatha in on what we know and see what happens from there. Could the message from the gnomes be any clearer? Love is in the air, or at least it will be once I sprinkle a little of my matchmaking magic. Ah, come see me again when you're ready for our next journey. All right. Well, looks like we got that done. That was cute. Oh, we're gonna go over here and send her to use uh, the bathroom. Maybe uh, grab a little something to eat. She's missing work today, but that's okay because she got it, uh, over 400 bucks just hanging out. So, I would say that makes up for her day of missing work. Snow is leaving her bike everywhere. Hopefully she doesn't lose that bike. I will be so upset if she loses her bike. <laughs> She has to develop her charisma and her guitar skills. But I think she has to do that for work. And we're not even sure if we're going to stay in this career. So we're not going to worry about that right now. Let's have her go over here and grab a little something to eat. Who's this guy? He's kind of cute. He kind of reminds me of Bob Pancakes too much though. <laughs> So grab something to eat here. Finally got her little um her little errand ran, so she's feeling good about that. Neighborhood brawl day. I know she's not gonna take part in that because she's a proper sim. Visit Finchwick, Old New Hempford, and also we can visit, maybe we'll just visit um, another neighborhood before we hit home. Let's, um, yeah, I think we're going to go visit another neighborhood before we go home. So I will see you guys there. All right, we have gotten here to the park. I don't even know how to pronounce that name. <laughs> I did not want to butcher that name, so I just said, we're here at the park. <laughs> but it's so pretty here. Look at this place, it is so nice. 
Who's this? Let's try to do a respectful introduction. This park is so pretty. Let's see what we can find. She's just standing here. Ooh, look at the moon. Look how pretty it is. I don't know who that sim was, but he just ran really far away. I don't think we're going to go off chasing him, but look at this view. It's, it's so pretty. Wow, this is a really nice view. I love this. So pretty. Let's go over here and splash around. This is a pond. Is that what that is? A pond? <laughs> Let's go over here and do a little splashing around in the pond. Look at this view, though. This moon looks so nice. I wonder if we can go over there. Is that like a ruin or... It just looks so nice over here. Let's try to get the a nice view. Oh, it looks so pretty. Uh-huh. She's like splashing around. So cool. Is that new? Look at oh look at the turtle. The dragonfly. I never seen a turtle in the game like this. I think this is new. This has to be new. So cool. Look at him. Uh -huh. Wow, that is so cool. I've never seen a turtle like this up at close. Whoa, he, <laughs> he went right back down in the water. That's so cool. Well, that was worth coming here just for that. <laughs> I think I'm going to send her back home, though. Meet you there. All right, we're back home. I was worried about my animals, so I just wanted to take a quick trip to the park, but everybody seems to be okay. I like, in the back of my mind, I'm like worried about my animals being healthy and not hungry and, you know, making sure they're okay while I'm gone. So it's good to know that while you're away, they won't go hungry. <laughs> Aw, so cute. Everybody's okay. Ah, oh, look at the mama. He's so cute. Oh, she's getting attacked by bees all of a sudden. <laughs> what was that about? Stung. She got stung for no reason. Well, that's unfortunate. But at least our animals are taken care of. And then nobody's hungry. Everybody's alright. So that's good. Our stove is in working condition again. Okay, we already replaced that. We got most of the money back. So I'm happy with that. But I I think I may. Oh, we got a gnome too. Look at that. Oh, I think we got the gnome for running the, the errand for Agatha and we got some cash. So that's good. We got almost all our money back. But I think I'm going to wrap it up here, guys. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.